Just ran out of ammo, it's in a handbag. Oh! Who are we gonna choose? The woman, she's got a gun. No. Why? Because I chose her before. And what happened? Look, you're gonna pick him and then he's gonna die this time. Save him. I'm probably gonna pick him and he's still gonna die and the woman's gonna get away. You chose to save Doug. Whoa. Now he hasn't got a gun. Still got a gun. Oh he's god. Not, might be able to go pick it up. So she died. So you saved the fucking kid with a polar bear t-shirt. Two enter, one lead. Watch this. That's his mother. Why? I was like, what the fuck? Why has he done that? Yeah, why has he done that? I don't know. He doesn't like you. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. I don't get why Larry punches me. Especially a good friend. What do you mean, especially a good friend? That's what you just said. I'm not letting someone else get eaten, especially a good friend. Is that it then? Do we? No, do we, there's do a we, little bit more. Do we find out why he punched you? No, not this episode. What an asshole! As soon as I got in the car, that would have been it. I would have shoved something through his head and thrown him out. I suppose you did just let his daughter get eaten. No, that's not his daughter. Oh. That's the reporter. His daughter is the one with the long hair, who you called bitch, and she moaned. Oh, don't call me bitch. All oh, right. I thought you... She moaned. That's his daughter. Zombies! 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 I thought you were going to sing the Plants vs Zombies song then. Oh god. I can't remember the words for that now. Something about There's zombies. a zombie on your lawn. <laughs> no, we don't like zombies on the lawn. You're tall, dark and undead. Or something like that. I think that might have been his mum. She's got similar hair. You know, one that had the screwdriver in her back. And then just got axed in the face. Yep. La, 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 la. Look, this is the motel where we're at. This is where we're going to be camping. Terry Tibbs. We have to talk to everybody here. Oh, God. Oh, dear. oh look, he's going to uh, Atlanta. I just can't stay here knowing that they That's where they are in the first season. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. Because Glenn is in the TV program. Mm. Glenn is in the TV program. I just said that. Yeah. See, so this could change it a little bit because what would the woman? bring to the thing that the little boy could and what the little boy bring to the thing that the woman couldn't. Had it? What? You saved the, you saved the man. Yeah. 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 Obviously he's going to do the different stuff to the woman. One, he won't have periods, so he won't be really angry. What? <laughs> do you not remember that on the TV series? No. Glenn's going on about how if women spend so much time together they link their menstrual cycle and get like massive strop-ons. <laughs> And then the old guy's just like, I wouldn't mention that to them if I were you. Because he's like, why is everyone being so moody? Like, I've read somewhere that if a lot of women stay together, they sync menstrual cycles or something. And they eat minstrels and go mental. Right. <laughs> Useful tips. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No but where's the fat shit now? have to take care of each other. Being a G. I hope he died. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. And I see I the type of guy who figures things, things out. I look at you and I, I see the type of guy who figures things out. Fine. That girl's gonna be just fine. Yeah. Thanks, Kitty. You got hey, do. Sha la 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 la. Oh, I don't have to talk to her, thank God. Or him. Wow, he's doing the exact same thing that the woman was doing when I saved her, rummaging around in that box. He could have at least changed it a bit. What's she doing that? Oh, well? he's fixing a laptop. What was she doing? Rummaging around in the box. I think. Or she might have been doing the same thing. Don't. 
We couldn't save her, could we? We couldn't save her, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I... I know it's stupid. We just met. It's dumb. Oh, we had a crush on her, and now he's going to hate you for not saving her. Yeah. I really liked her. Oh, sorry, Dad. It's okay. Thanks, though. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it, buddy? How did you choose? Tell him he's like the best. You picked me. Um, Just thought I was going to help you both, because that makes you... No. <laughs> I didn't! Oh! Oh. Sometimes we don't make choices. Just do what we do. I just wish you would have picked her. You just said I wish you'd picked her. Yeah. Well, so do I. She had a gun, but I've seen it before. <laughs> so. Oh, we don't want to speak to Duck. Duck and Clemmy. Look, that Bit of a duck. Look, why has he got such a fucking fat nose? Toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh. Do you want to cool it for a minute? You want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. After this, can we watch some? Oh, watch some what? Walking Dead. Yeah. No, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. Must be really oh, interesting for the people down there. <laughs> Hello. 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 Um. So it can't help us. So it can't really help us. But I know. It's just I need it. I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Oh, even his writing's red. Like his face. It's always been red. Oh, I haven't even noticed. Another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Um, yeah. Yeah, she's great. <laughs> <laughs> I like pissing him off. <laughs> Say or what? Or uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer, and you were before it was something you had to do to stay Either. alive. I know who you are, I know and I don't who give you a shit about what happened. I don't give a shit about what happened. But if anything happens, that to my daughter, little girl, daughter, 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 yes. Hey, oh, Lee? wouldn't it be amazing if you had a split? second? So they could watch half the screen and watch us like this. <laughs> no. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? you okay? Yeah. Mm. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Oh dear. Why, so then they could see you putting the fucking camera right in my face? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's the sound of us winning this thing. Give me a shave. I know, leave me alone. You look like a wookie. <laughs> leave, leave me alone, don't be such a bully. Stay here until the military rolls through. I actually ah. agree with that plan. Me too. Got it's like the perfect hideout, isn't it? And most importantly, Why? Because they've got light. bed, water, light. Worst places to call home. Yeah, but watch. Right. Because oh. obviously that happens in zombies. Yeah. Don't really. Get to be continued! Oh my god. Right, well, there we go. That is the first chapter. No, episode. Episode, sorry. Oh, look, they got a trailer for episode two. Let's watch this. Let's watch the trailer. From what I've seen, well, I've seen it already, so yeah. It looks very good, the next episode. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the war. They'd starve us out. I never expected they'd starve us out. You look like crap, Lee. Energy bar! Keep fit! Keep it. Hey, I owe you a lot more than a half-eaten candy bar. How you doing, Clementine? Oh. I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Don't repeat what happened with the walkers at Herschel's farm. You choose the kids this time. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. That was a bit different. The walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. Are they literally firing arrows? Yeah. <gasps> Maybe it's uh, Dale. No, I don't think it is actually. Dale's not that much of an arsehole. I'm just doing the same thing. We know this guy's not gonna make it. 
I like his bolt action rifle. That he doesn't have to cop. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you, you cop this one once, 20 bullets or so go into the chamber. Lovely. Lee, please. Oh my god, who was that? <laughs> I think it might have been Larry or Kenny or a new character. You have to slice his head off. Right, well that's it. Thanks for watching. These are our statistics. Uh, we were 60% honest. To her, sure. 51% of players chose Sean. So I, I Doug or Carly? What? Yeah. I'm not very good there. <laughs> Why would you choose Doug then? There's really no point. But yeah, you only 15% reason, of players choose Doug. I only chose it because I'd seen what happens when you choose Lady. So anyway, that's um, episode one of The Walking Dead. Uh, we'll be doing the next episode this month, as that's when it comes out. See you next time. Bye! We're such legends. <laughs>